guys, it's me, Pikmin Master 123 here with another video, and today, we are playing one of my favorite games, Total Tank Simulator. This is a battle simulator over World War, Summer World War 1, but also World War 2, and it's just a really fun game, and they also added scenarios and workshop stuff, and a bunch of other added stuff to the sandbox and shadow modes, so that you guys can experience a lot more of this game. But um, right now, we're going into the campaign, and today, we finished the U.S. campaign, and all of its stuff, and now, we're moving on to Poland. Because, well, this game was made by noobs from Poland, so might as well do the Poland act, which, it's a defensive act, and act two is an offensive. Okay, this so this is all during World War II. That's good. Um, let's name this the truth. So, if you didn't know, during uh, World War II, Poland actually had the superior tanks because their tank cannons could actually do more damage than the uh, German tank cannons. Their armor wasn't as good, but it could still pierce through even Panzer III's. So, I want to see if they actually put that in here, if they made it better. Act 1, Poland. 9, 1979. Armia Niemiecka przekroczyła nasze granice. Musimy więc walczyć w obronie ojczyzny. Obronę przeprowadzimy w czterech etapach. Na każdym z nich będziesz mógł zdecydować się na podjęcie walki lub na odwrót. Pamiętaj, że twoim priorytetem jest wygranie ostatniej bitwy. Mniej wykwalifikowany dowódca zapewni nam pomniejsze zwycięstwo. Do tego potrzebna jest tylko wygrana ostatniej misji. Jednak ty nie jesteś mniej wykwalifikowany, prawda? Wygranie czterech bitew będzie dla nas znaczącym zwycięstwem. Kiedy wygrasz wszystkie bitwy, będziemy mogli mówić o znakomitym zwycięstwie. Okay, so, so they, this is in English, by the way, in the English mode. I guess they just wanted that there for a reference of how the languages sound, which I think that's pretty cool. So this one has a lot of defensive missions. So let's see what we actually have here. We have. 7,500, zero of that, broken victory, we got offers, I'm pretty sure this is just how you pronounce this in English, that's pretty cool, okay just looking at all that, we got, we got tanks and troops that we're fighting against, something tells me we're gonna be going up against the Blitzkrieg strategy, so, Ooh, we got a lot of infantry available because this this was for the US was under second act now It's half we got Act one has a lot of tanks. Let's see what we already have. We have the basic infantry. We have the PZLP.7 fighter plane 400 armor. That's a lot more armor than the some of the others I'm surprised it doesn't take off the uh, rotors that it fires. We got the minefield uh, or QF 25 pounder. Um, an armored car. This one does have a machine gun on it. It just has a small cannon. That ain't good. Um, let's see here. We got the tank recovery. We got a deep release. And we also got a 7 TP. This also doesn't have a machine gun. Um,. Let's see what our upgrades are. Mobile artillery. Better artillery. So we got the pirate tank. That's not that good. We got a kamikaze tank. No machine gun again. We got... We don't We don't got any machine guns. This one's the only one that has two turret cannons. It still doesn't have a machine gun on the tank. Bruh. We have to wait till act two to get machine guns. Although, this, wait, this is under main tanks, but it counts as a artillery kit, artillery? You got two machine guns, a flamethrower, an AA gun, and a cluster bomb. And that health goes up a thousand points. A thousand four hundred from the last one. That's actually really good, although it goes slow. 
actually just goes the same speed as these two. This one just goes slower. Um, we also get some more medium tanks. But literally, we don't get any machine guns whatsoever. This is gonna be bad. Well, better, better go into mission one. We're gonna also split this in half. Also, off camera, I actually got a mission done, which was an achievement, which is for completing the entire US campaign with everything unlocked. So I went back, played it again, beat every single mission in it, which you already saw in, if you watched the last few videos. And yeah, pretty much all the missions are done now. Okay, finally loaded back in, and we're going to go straight into this mission. Okay, it's a wave defense, so this is only the first wave. We got five light tanks, Panzer 38s. But these guys got. Wait, how many machine guns do these have? They have a main cannon and three machine guns, and one rotating machine gun. And they have a bunch of troops back here. Normal riflemen, it looks like. And we only get 36,000. This is gonna be bad. Okay. I guess we get two. Why are these rotating backwards? I don't want them to rotate that direction. We're gonna need three. I'm getting three of these because it's gonna be our best bet against those tanks. Um, our light tanks. If we place this down and hover over this. Oh. Our tanks are severely underpowered. What about, what about this? Artillery is better than light armor. No armor. What does this say? So all of our stuff is worse? Apparently. Okay, what about our... Yeah. All of our stuff is worse. This is gonna be bad. Okay. So I guess I'm gonna try the old strategy. Armored cars do not have a machine gun, which doesn't give me much use for them other, uh, other than distracting. Also, they're much faster than our tanks are right now. So we're just gonna spread a bunch of these out. And at least they have a turret, which means they do more damage versus tanks, but they don't do anything against, um, uh, it, everything else. Let's also get two repair vehicles because we know we're gonna need those. And, um... And just fill the battlefield with more troops. You know what? Poland did have a lot of troops. Didn't have that many tanks. But I'm pretty darn sure that their tanks had machine guns when they had them. Oh, crap. Dude, just machine gun and everything over there. Their machine guns do so much damage against our tanks. I'm repairing. Gotta repair really quick. But why do they do that much damage? We're, we are beating them, but still. What just shot me? You gotta take out these teams fast. Oh crap, our troops are getting. Our troops are bombing themselves! They just threw a bunch of grenades at their own dudes! Also, I'm, I'm gonna try and save as many of these tanks as possible, because let's just admit it, we're gonna need them. What about you? Yeah, you heal up. I guess we're on tank healing duty because our tanks don't heal themselves. So why am I inside of a house? Okay, that guy's dead. Try 
trying not to do any friendly fire, but it's hard when almost all of my troops are. Also, I like how the enemy doesn't really heal. It's all up to me. For my units, but it doesn't really affect... Oh, crap. Oh, nice! That reco our recovery vehicles are actually doing work! I'm gonna go on ahead and heal that recovery vehicle soon. It's at half armor. So we still got a decent amount of troops. I don't know what this final wave is gonna be. All I know is we're taking out the German tanks. I'm pretty sure the German tanks have better cannons than us though. Which shouldn't be true. Just saying that. Cause I, like, realistically in World War II, Ger German tanks, like the, the more advanced German tanks had better armor, but the rest, no. The rest of it was trash. Yeah, I'm just gonna preemptively use that. And, oh crap, you don't even have any armor. Yeah, we're repairing you all the way up. Armor car, get away. Actually. Nice, we were able to repair the armor car. Which they target with your machine guns. Ah, I didn't know that. Well, that sucks. We're, we are getting hammered by all these waves. Like, we're taking out more than we have, that's for sure. But, uh... Oh, all those guys just bombed themselves. I think that was a pretty good trade. Where are these troops? Oh. Bomb, 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 bomb. Come on, come on, run these guys over. Come on! Got him. Yeah, that, there is a quest for that, so I really need this. Like, with these last little guys, I'm just gonna... Okay, where is this dude that I get to run over? Ooh. Y'all take a free heal and a free armament. Really good. So all of my tanks are apparently going after the guy behind me. Oh, nope, all of them are now turning around to go after who knows what else. Um, so yeah, oh. You're not a guy. Also, you think the machine guns would still start at the tanks, because they use machine guns and they just start at the tanks. Like, when I'm, whenever I'm controlling this, I normally just control the machine gun that's at the front of the turret, because the... The tank suits everything. The machine gun does not suit everything for some reason. Rotate slower than mine, so I can just start doing this. And we, that was the last of their wave, we won. But yeah, this really, I think this campaign is really so in Poland to not have as many people though. Like, we were fighting more than we actually put there. Let's see the summary. Yeah, they had a lot more units on the field. Specifically tanks. That's what it means by all the units that were lost. Also, 250 research. That's not that much research. What do we have left? We got planes that we have to deal with and artillery. Okay. How much... Okay, sniper, they got a rifle, pistol, knife, grenade, 
med kit and a molotov. These have throwy knives, sticky bombs, med kits, grenades, knives, a better. Is that the same pistol? Yeah, that's the same pistol. And a sniper rifle. The sticky bombs is why I'm getting this unit. Those are really good against tanks in this game. Um, we also got 200 research and 250. Is this a... Oh, yeah, these guys have um, rockets and sticky bombs and grenades. That's a good combo. Uh, SMG, a pretty good SMG. These have a uh, tank rifle, pistol, knife, and that. Okay. And then we got artillery cannons. Now, these ones are slight upgrades to this with only a 40 more cost, but does give it a lot of armor and health. Um, but the fact that they're getting air units means we're getting this for sure. Okay, and then what are the upgrades to this? We got a mobile one and that. And what is this special? A transport plane. This is gonna be good, guys. Okay, and I think next battle is gonna be have to be our last one. But uh, first, what else can we get? What costs a hundred? I am really debating getting this because this explodes in a radius. Ooh, a 30 explosion radius. That's actually pretty darn good. And then an infantry. This has a. Uh, what is the radius? Oh, it doesn't even show us the radius. I wish it showed you more stats for that. Because we just got the anti air, we're going against the air units. Okay, we are back and. Okay, what do they have? They got some fighter planes, some dive bombers. Uh, tactical bombers defense they got two AA guns oh my gosh these are impossible to attack from the ground and the air these things focus ground units more than air units like they just shoot straight forward these are like upgraded machine guns and the machine guns they got this weird glitch where they just fire for no reason so I don't even know that they got Panzer threes oh these tanks are supposed to have better barrels than these realistically they're supposed to have better better turrets than all of these. I don't know about the Panzer 1B. Oh, these are just kamikazes. Yeah. Definitely better barrels than those. Infantry with... Why would you put the flamethrower infantry behind normal infantry? I, I don't understand that, but okay. They got some art, art, anti-armor and some snipers. Okay, so we're gonna want these AA guns out in the open. You don't want them behind the forest, that's for sure. So, we're setting these up. These also work against ground units and tank units, which is pretty good. Um, and we're really limited. Okay, we're also gonna want one artillery, one artillery, and one more artillery back here. Good. Okay, next thing. I'm thinking a defensive line of vehicles right here. Like just a little spread amount. Then some light tanks in front of this. It's a little bit less light tanks in front of that. This is gonna be very good, guys. And, um, if we lose, I, I will reload. Like... I'm gonna reload the game if we lose this battle. Because I'm going for a ton of things all at the same time. So we got that little group over there. And then we're ha gonna get... Okay, sniper's gonna be useful for these houses. So just... One per building, I guess. And then... And then the rest, I guess we could just... I really wish we had more money. Okay, give orders. 
Okay, artillery attack. We're just gonna be focusing this chokehold right there, or this more confined space. It's not much of a chokehold, it's just a really sort of. They, they got a key point right here, so these guys are gonna be going here, here, and here a lot more. So it's just a really nice location. And because I don't wanna deal with these anti air, I'm just taking that out right now. Troops over here. Just get take cover. I, you guys are just gonna. Okay, you guys, I want you to flank left across to here. I feel like telling these guys up front to just defend for like. I wish you could do 15, but I guess 30 seconds, and then. They almost... Oh, they pretty much did get me. Oh! There goes my turret I was in. Oh, nice. We got it down. Yeah, I'll just leave this one to what it's, what I've been doing. Where's the other one? Okay, nice. These are these are also anti-tank guns, so I'm gonna be using this anti-tank. Uh oh, I accidentally helped hit my own guy. We got a blue tank coming over this right side. Nice. Our, art our artillery is doing work. I'm also gonna make it so that reloads right now because we're gonna need to reload. Nice, it's gonna start slowing down because it doesn't have the fuel. Right in front of me is like two of those TKS things. I don't know exactly what that is. Probably the. Oh, it's just two units. Pop. Okay, tell me that this is gonna be an insta kill if you get hit by a small turret cannon. Tell me that's gonna be an instant one hit KO. last guy I'm just gonna also the developers haven't up updated this game in a while so there are bugs you could see one right there with these guys getting stuck on the roof and the sides of the walls it's sort of just a thing that happens I was the developers did a really good job on this game but I hope that they just fixed the bugs or just left in the game Ooh, we got a decent reward there and a lot of money and a lot of research there we go. Tech tree. Okay. S and Z two guys. We're gonna need you. And yeah, they have the uh, grenades and they got the sticky bombs. And you guys. Yes, there's the ATR rifles. Ooh. It's like a little it's the grenade shot that's on the end of the rifles, that little add on. We got a pistol What's this? Yeah. Is that an underbarreled 
Okay, and um, Molotov. So it was a good two for ground and tank units. And then the planes are not going to do us good on this act. That's the truth. Heck, I don't think the planes are going to do us very much good, period. We also got this. I'm going to buy this eventually because it's like a 10 buck increase for 75 armor. <laughs> That's pretty decent. We're not going to get these guys just yet. We're going to need more money. But for right now, I think that's going to be it. Hope you guys enjoyed. Feel free to like, subscribe, and check out some of these other videos that you're seeing on the side of the screen. Also, feel free to join the Discord. We got down in the description and also on the Discord and also on the community tab. We got a little pamphlet for you guys to fill out to see like what you guys want to see next. Hope you guys enjoy. Thank you for watching, and I'll see you guys later. Bye, guys.